So here is a quick review of the sequence page that we did in our Zoom meeting. We begin with writing our name. I'm going to write Steve here because that is my name. Hopefully you will be writing your own name there. In this first box, we're going to do the order of things that we do when we get up in the morning. So before we start Zoom classes or before uh, we do our chores or maybe doing your chores as part of it. But in this first box on the lines, I'm going to start my sentence and I'm going to start it with the word first. And because it is the first word, I'm using a capital F. So first, and then I put a comma, I get out of bed. Then on the box on this left hand side, I'm going to draw a picture of me getting out of bed. If you do something else, if getting out of bed is not the first thing you do, I want you to write the first thing that you do when you get up in the morning. So you can tell that um, I am, even though I love art, it is not my strongest skill. So I have me getting out of bed. In this second box, I'm going to start my sentence with the word next. So I have next with the capital N because it starts my sentence. I say next, I. I is also capitalized because it's a very important word because you're talking about yourself. I brush my teeth. And then I end my sentence with a period. So I start with a capital, end with a period. And then I'm going to draw me brushing my teeth. Here I am with my teeth. And then I have my toothbrush here, and I'm brushing my teeth. In the third box, I'm going to start my sentence with the word then. So then, with a comma, I eat breakfast with a period. Now, if you do something else, if you have to do some chores or you have to feed the animals, I want you to write what you do in the morning, not what I do. So then I eat breakfast, and I eat breakfast at a counter. So I have my little bowl of cereal. I have my bowl of cereal. I have my picture. If you would like to take more time on your pictures, that would be great. You can color them in. And then the last box, I'm going to start my sentence with the word finally. And writers use the word finally to give their readers a signal. And they're signaling the reader that this is the last item in the series or the last item in the sequence. So finally, at least for me, I go to work. So then I will draw my quick illustration. and I go to work. And this is our sequence. So we start at the beginning. So first, next, start that over. First, next, then, and finally. And when we write sentences, 
and then move into paragraphs, we're going to be using some of these signal words to keep all of our ideas organized. Please let me know if you have any questions. You can reach out to me by text, email, or on Google Classroom.